to these, uh, uh, you know, terrorist organizations trying to permeate into, uh, you know, the social fabric of Kerala. Do you think it's perhaps the decency with which Kerala has performed itself in the last few decades? Or do you think that the people over there are uh, perhaps being radicalized at a place and time where not too much is being noticed? You know, perhaps we, we, we believe that nothing can go wrong in Kerala, so we have not worried about it too much. And that perhaps has been uh, misused by some nefarious or enemies of the state. Vinny, uh, thank you. Good to see you again. Uh, well, I think this, the, whatever you said is the overall perception of the state of Kerala, because Kerala has always been known as a God's own country, and most of the social uh, the, the, uh, system in, 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 the, in, the, in the state of Kerala is known to be the benchmark for the country, whether it is in terms of education, health, and so on and so forth. But this is, I'm very happy the new sector has taken up this particular issue on the national television that this is some of the case which we, I have been talking about from the last 15 years or so. The alarming Muslim radification, uh, uh, radicalization in the state of Kerala, especially on the northern part of Kerala. In fact, I hail from a uh, district which is in the north, north Malabar region of a place called as Kannur. That is a place where I hail from. If you really look at it from the last 30 years, even though there may be a history even before that, but for, the last 30 years, there is a continuous change has taken place in the, uh, in the state of Kerala, especially in the North Malabar region, starting from, there is even a district which most of the people uh, in the north of India would not even knowing, even like a person like you would not be knowing that there is a district which is almost dedicated to the Muslims called as Malapuram, where exactly this Calicut, uh, the air crash happened. Then there is a, another district which is called as Calicut. There is another district called as Kandur and then Kasargod. These are, and then why not? The famous uh, were uh, the, the Yuvraj uh, actually uh, is an MP from. So the, there was a huge amount of Muslim Islam radicalization has taken place in this particular region. And the population of Muslims have grown in many fold in this region. Let me tell you, even when I was a kid, when I used to walk around and uh, wherever it may, you won't find too many people who are wearing a burqa. You won't find that many moors all across. Today, the situation in this particular part of the state is completely changed. You will find the people who are uh, dressed more of like an, uh, in an Afghanistan or in the Syrian or in the Middle East style. You will find the, uh, the, the ladies from Muslim ladies are wearing a comp 